All right. Yo, real fast, bro. We were about to start a quick challenge. What that's going to be, we're going to test out a new method, essentially. So it's going to be a strategy that has been uh, produced from the group chat, my Discord group. And, you know, shout out the community. I'm going to give the credit where credit is due, but we'll do all that and release the strategy after we do the challenge. I'm going to break down the challenge real quick. What I kind of decided, and this is just all off the fly, we're going to do 0.1 into 10 of these plays, 10 of these coins. At the end of, you know, these 10 plays, we're going to see if this is, you know, more likely to work or to not, essentially. Of course, this is not going to be the... You know the fucking end all be all answer however it's just a fun challenge let's fucking make this happen my dogs be printing off this i've made money off it as well before so i would love to put it to the test let's tap into my dogs in the discord alk have any of your filters changed great question i have set the market cap as low as like 4k i'm not rocking with that right this moment but um on the condition that the dev is holding zero then uh you know i'm looking for it to see like what the holders do see if they continue to hold it see if more buyers step in literally the lowest risk um, that you can have on a play because it can't really go much lower like, okay uh, in all honesty because it's a pump play yeah now Pump progress, 99%. Max holders, 35. Dev hold percent, 1%. Market cap, 4K. So Giga Trump. This just came up on the, with those filters. Let's look at it slightly. 92 holders already, seven minutes. How much? I, um, I, I, I took a piece at 14. I, okay. I bought a little. So coming from the man himself, that's gonna be the first play, 0. 0.1. And look, I mean, it's already profitable. <laughs> if you wanted to sell out, you could, but I'm. I'm not going to sell out for 70 cents. I think, uh, you know, I'm paying more in gas than that shit. But, yeah, that's, uh, let's let it cook real quick. In the meantime, I will look for the second one because, you know, the play's got to cook. And the other ones, you know, they can pop up real quick. Mm -hmm. You want to you wanna see it as soon as that dev sells, pretty much. These plays have volume behind them. That's why I just kind of, like, assessed things really quick and then jumped into this one. Uh, dev just sold. This meat in my filters. And then, um, you know, we got 28K volume in the last five minutes on a 16K, you know, market cap token whenever I was looking at it. Or I guess Hell it was yeah. at like 14 or whatever. Okay. Hell so yeah. for that reason, it's like, well, I mean, the play's moving. It's right there in the meta. Uh, up 68% right now. Yeah. You know, using the strategy up, uh, I mean, that's a quick 40% up. And I didn't really, yeah, in, even in my own head, I didn't really put a fucking limit on when I'm gonna sell and what not like that. However, uh, I guess we'll just play this, you know, by ear for each play. This play, I think it's already a W because if somebody wanted to jump in here and make 30%, uh, you know, they could have, essentially. We're getting it so low that uh, we're so early, you know, there's right? nobody, like there's only a couple people that are even aware of it right now. What if it catches on, uh, you know, some people start talking about it you know, on fucking X or whatever. Next two or three days, people start to pick it up more. So you know, shout out Moonbag? Add, what, 14K, you know what I mean? So. You say shout out Moonbag though, right? <laughs> yeah, shout Tell out vibe, yeah. No, you have to. No, I'm, guys, it's not a joke, okay? I literally, in the last month, missed out on $400,000 of potential profit because I didn't leave the Moonbag like I normally would on just these two plays because I was high or tired or whatever the fuck. And literally, those are the plays that ran, and I did the math. 400K I slept on. Tough. So don't, don't be like me. Oh, Bro, my it's God. disgusting. And that's the thing, man. I think that's what, you know, people always ask me and question me about the moon bag. It's like, bro, you know, okay, I understand why, you know, you might not get it or feel as deeply as I do. However, you got to fucking, you got to get hit by that shit in your chest at least one time, you know. Hamza, oh, there we have go. You tried to yeah, so. make sure make sure that you're logged into the Telegram that's associated uh, with your full X. Aves into the next play of this challenge, so um, we're up 16 percent. Ooh, oh wow, it's gone, it's gone. Okay, this was the next ape of the challenge, and of course, you know we're gonna be smart. 
Let's be smart real quick. Took out a little fifty percent. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's gone. Rest is a moon bag. So this is played two of our ten play challenge, and we're two for two. I mean, especially with some of these, like you can the way you're catching those percentages so quick. It's like you don't need. Honestly, if you're going like a solar more on a play, it's like you don't, you know, you don't need that 300% every single time. Right. You can definitely eat off the 20, 50, you know, it just stacks and stacks and stacks. So. so the only reason I'm selling right now, by the way, is just so I can get my initial back and moon bag the rest. And actually, while this might be the, this literally might be the fucking, the strategy of a lifetime, truly. Because, okay, I'll jump in here. I'll get my little, I'll get my percentage, you know, 30, 40%, whatever. But imagine leaving that moon bag and say, you know, one of these, because these are new plays on pump. One of them runs, you know, does a stupid run, right? That moon bag is going to make you dumb fucking bread. But you don't care about it because you already got your initial, you already got your profit out a little bit, right? But we'll see. We'll see. Let's let it cook. You know, we're two for two right now. And look, th yeah, there's no risk for me because I got my initial out. I have a, I have a dollar in profit, right? So this is really just me getting my fucking, you know, me betting on it might blow, if that makes sense. Yeah, I think it depends, you know. It's just like uh, what, what your approach is, you know. I think if you're in a position where you're trying to, like, build up a bag, you know, you want to go heavy uh on your positions but you want to get out quick so yep. you know yeah, exactly i'm kind of stuck in solana that. and i'm putting like a solana in a play then you know i'm happy with like 20 percent, 25 percent. let me lock that in but now if you're trying to catch the runners that's whenever this other strategy i think is is really key because you can lock in at least baseline profitability and then the rest of it's kind of a gamble you know it's just gonna we're playing the lottery to try to catch the couple that come through the filters that actually do run because there seems to be uh, a theme where uh, some of these runners do come through the filters and uh, you know if you just kept some in it you would have you would have had it right there fair and uh, i'm not gonna lie i did ape the third play it was an ape i didn't consult but we'll see what happens we'll see where it goes while that uh while the third play is cooking i'm now going to go back to this one look at that we're up 40 percent already now it went down to 30 percent, but it's cool while we're up in profit let me you know take out a little bit this is just proving that if you wanted to buy in sell out real quick you know that's a quick 30 percent gang oh 50 percent up okay cool and look i'm just gonna you know take a little bit of profits out dude i have point i'm playing with point one bro i could literally just leave it all in there but whatever, let's leave the rest, because I don't, whatever. All right, next. Okay. We're three for three. That's three for three. Confirmed. Let's see what the plays are doing. Okay. Came down a little bit. I'm going to let that cook. I don't give a fuck, honestly. So we had three plays. Billy No Ear. Okay, fair. Giga Trump. Cool. Still up. And we've been letting it cook. 20%, um, you know, whatever. I'm not sure if this is going to do anything more, so I'm going to sell 50. Let me at least get my initial back. That should be initials, right? Yeah, easy. That's Giga Trump. We got Billy No Ear. That shit's still cooking. Oh, wow, yeah, that was the first play, actually. And my average buy price is 20K. It's at 16k right now, but I'm still up 20%. Of course, we're looking at percents. We're not looking at the price because it's a easy challenge. It's all right. We're looking for the next play. So yeah, we hit. Actually, it was these three. It was literally these three: Giga Trump, Inside Job, and Billy with no ear. The three out of ten plays we did, we might have to fuck around and uh, reduce it to five. However, we're going crazy. The Billy play is about to bond. Look at that fucking chat. Is it really? Yo. 
I'm looking at this one real you, quick. You were spot on with that call. I think. Oh wow, yeah, it is going. Shit. There's not more bullish price action than that. <laughs> okay. Well, we're up a uh, hundred and thirty-eight percent, hundred forty percent right now. Cool. I'm sorry, I did have to sell a little 25%. I gotta get the initial up. I can sleep comfortably now. Cause imagine I'm up 140% and I wake up and it's just dust and you know, I'm at zero now. Wow, yay, Giga Trump is, is going. And look, this is why it's so important. Beautiful example. You have to prioritize getting your initial back as well as profit. You know, we're all here to make money so, you know, I'm down. If I didn't sell anything, I'm down 50%. But this shit is down 50% and I'm still up, you know, 14. Oh, that's the one I... Wait, is that you, right? Yeah. I was just looking at it right now. Like, I had the, the chart pulled up for a nice minute here. Yeah, the, I mean, actually, let's do it. I know I don't want to... I hate buying the top, but I got to buy it. So, point one, this is the fourth play uh, in the, the strategy. We'll see, though. I like the holders have been going up. It did pop up in my filters, but I didn't ape right away, essentially. This shit running up right now is officially four for four of the plays. Damn. In terms of the strategy. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. I mean, and look, I mean, I'll, I'll show you guys what I do. I'm up 50%. Bro, take your fucking money out, bro. Get your initials out at least. You kidding me? That's four for four, though. Let's get it. I love it. I love the community that's being built because I'm not some dude that's sitting behind a random ass screenshotted picture, right? Uh, like yeah, on Twitter. Right exactly, yeah. I'm not like just sending out contract addresses and shit. I don't do that. I'll just show you guys what I'm doing. snipes the tops. <laughs> shit, bro. Low key, right? I don't <laughs> on that last chart too, man. Dude, good looking out, bro. All right, fellas. So the stream did end rather abruptly. So real quick, I want to go over all the plays that we did. I said 10 at the beginning. Then I reduced it to five, but we only ended up doing four because it was getting late. The plays were coming slower and we didn't want to force any. So four plays, four profitable wins. Let me show you guys what we cooked up with this new method. So what I'm going to do is oops, show you the percentage of potential if we held to the top. Of course, actually, I'll show my position because each one was a point one. And I each one, I did leave a moon bag as well, just in case. Right. So first play Giga Trump, 1000 percent if I held and sold at the top. Beautiful, right? Second play, inside job, let's get it. It's kind of an ugly chart just because I did it on 15 minute, but let me show you a prettier one real quick. This one, I got some pretty good sales selling at the top over there, but let's, uh, let's see what that potential was if I sold the whole bag. 65%, not bad, beautiful. Let's go to my position here. See, so it only ended um, with a light PNL because I was prioritizing the moon bag essentially because these are only 0.1 buy ins, right? So, next one, let's go here. Our third win of the night. Bounce back. First buy over there. So, close to the top. 277% on here. My position, we ended with the little 30% banger. Last play of the night that night. Let me show you, zoom out. Yes, sir. So boom. From the average buy price all the way to the top, just about 546%. And our position on here, we were up 12%. So what a beautiful stream. What a beautiful method. Now, if this video gets 100 likes, bro, I'm going to start jumping in these plays with one Solana each. And do the same exact thing. A beautiful challenge just to show you guys that this shit is the new method. This is a beautiful way. However, I'm glad you guys are here. Man, hopefully you guys are printing with this shit. But peace.